this was not an ocean-filled fjord 15,000 years ago. It was a landlocked valley. That during the last ice age, the glacier filled in with ice right up to the tops of these mountains and down to the valley floor. 15,000 years ago, during the last ice age, glaciers up to one mile thick blanketed the inside passage of Alaska and carved out this incredible scenery. We can see signs of glacial scrape. All those grooves and striations in that solid rock the way it's been scraped, scarred and marred, sliced and diced, that was all done by ice, even up near the tops of these mountains. outside and you take a deep breath right now, you are breathing some of the purest air on the planet. We have a huge mountain coming right out of the middle of the fjord, seemingly blocking our path. It's as if right now we are cruising in a box canyon, sealed off to the rest of the world. The South Sawyer Glacier carved out this amazing canyon during the last ice age, now coming into view, pale blue color, 7,000 foot snow-capped mountains above it. That river of ice winds back into British Columbia for 21 miles. Where the ice mass comes down to the ocean, it is one half mile 
wide or across the face, and it is 300 feet tall from the ocean to the top icy spire. sign a man in this wild remote fjord you know looking around here you might ask ourselves what could we do to improve this place nothing 
Leave nature alone and it creates such stunning beauty. Henry David Thoreau said it best, in wildness is the preservation of the world.